Hello children, good morning all of you. Today for class 9, ICC, CBSC, West Bengal Board or any state board also. Factorization part 4. That means you have already got 3 lessons. You must go through that lesson. Now please pay your attention on the board. Sums given from ML Agarwal exercise 4.3. Sum number 2 part 2. After looking the sum, you have to understand in which frame we have to factorize. Here, we have to remember difference of two square. That is a square minus b square equal to a plus b into a minus b. In both sides, you have to remember this frame of formula. A, a square minus b square equal to a plus b into a minus b or a plus b into a minus b equal to a square minus b square. So, after writing the sum, this is not exactly in the frame of formula. If we take common, then we are getting 16x square minus 9y square. Still now, we are not getting the frame. If we make it whole square, that is 4x whole square, and 3y whole square, then a square minus b square. Now we are getting the frame of formula that is this. a square minus b square equal to a plus b into a minus b. Here in place of a, here is 4x. In place of b, that is 3y. So 2 into 4x plus 3y into 4x minus 3y. This is the answer. If you follow the step, then easily you will understand. Next sum, same way, that is... After looking the sum, we have to convert the frame of the formula this, this frame. This is not exactly in, in this frame. So 9x square, we may write 3x whole square. Here is 4. So we may write it 2 into y plus 2x whole square. Then we may multiply this. Then we are getting the a square minus b square. In place of a, that is 3x. In place of b, that is 2y plus 4x. Now, by applying the formula, that is a plus b into a minus b. Here, minus, there are two terms. This is why we have to keep this term within first bracket. When you will eliminate the bracket, then this sign will be changed. After that, we have to addition and subtraction, that is 3x plus 4x, that is 7y. Here 3x minus 4x, that is minus x minus 2y. When you will see any minus is coming from first, then we have to take common minus. After taking the common minus, this sign will be changed, so it will be plus. So finally the answer is this. This is the answer. You must write this answer. Next, sum number 6, part 2. After writing the sum, we have to think what will be common. Here 6a in the both terms, so uh, C, not 6a, that is pi a. After taking the common pi a, we are getting this. This is not exactly in the frame of formula. This is why you have to make it form. Uh, this is why a square whole square and pi b whole square. Then we are getting a square minus b square. Then by applying the formula a plus b into a minus b, we will we'll get the answer. Next, this is also not exactly in the frame. After writing the sum, we have to multiply that is a minus b into a plus b that is a square minus b square. Then by simplifying, we are getting x square minus 1 square. 1, 1 we may make it square. Then we are getting the frame that is a square minus b square. So, a plus b into a minus b. This is the answer. Next sum x minus 2y minus x square plus 4. After writing the sum, we have to take the common. After taking common, we are getting this sign will be changed. Then it will be a square minus b square. By applying the formula a plus b into a minus b, then x minus 2y, x minus 2y will be the common. Then what will remain here? 1 minus. Here, before bracket minus so we we have to write to write within first bracket when bracket will be eliminate then 
sign also will be changed here is plus so it will be minus so finally we are getting x minus 2y into y minus x minus 2y this is the answer if you follow the step attentively easily you will understand first you have to remember the formula a square minus b square that is a plus b into a minus b if the frame of expression exactly given then no matter but you have to express in the frame of a square minus b square then you have to factorize okay thank you everybody